Hi guys, here's the uh, weekly update. And as you can see, uh, this week we have some good news and unfortunately we do have some bad news. First pair of red factors, uh, second round, four chicks coming on really well, um, really well. So, um, looks like I've got another lightly variegated one there, possibly tick, but we shall see. And then Second, second pair. Uh, I've just got a bath in there, so as you can see, she's uh, hens wet. I've left them together for this one. Uh, first round. Unfortunately, I only got two chicks out of her. Uh, third one died, but they seem to be getting on fine. There's no squabbling at the moment, so she has built a nest. Um, so hopefully, at some point during the week, she'll start laying. Down on to the third pair. And uh, unfortunately in this one, her first round, there is only one chick. Um, coming on very well though. I need to change the nest later. But um, yeah, doing very well. No feeding problems with this one. Cockbird has been uh, trying to get to her for the second round. I have noticed they've been feeding each other down here. So, um, yeah, I might give it a few more days and then um, put a wire divider in and see how they go. But, yeah. Moving on to the lizards and... Uh, I had some very bad news with this one, only one egg hatched out of four, um, but about two, three days after that one died, it was flat as a pancake. The hen had uh, obviously just carried on sitting, sitting and uh, suffocated. So um, yeah, separated, taken the nest out, um, I'm going to give it about a week or so and then I'm going to start them again. Yeah, not very good, not very happy with that one. These things happen. Moving on down here, and as you can see, three chicks uh, rung them this morning. Um, so, yeah, looks like I've got two opals and one yellow agate. It's got a bit of a crooked beak, that one there in the middle. Uh, I noticed it when it was young. I did ask on the uh, colour canary, so apparently these things happen. It, it shouldn't have a problem eating seeds and it might well grow out. But yeah. Shan't be long before I put these on the second round. So, uh, yep, uh, moving on to the final pair. As you can see, four chicks out there. One opal and three yellow agates. Left the cockbird with these. Um, he does a brilliant job, unlike the cockbird above that all he wants to do is swallow with every bird you put him with. Yeah, um, Ben has built for, well, I'm guessing it's going to be her third round. Um, we'll see. Um, whether she does or not, um, I haven't normally, first and second round when I put these pairs together, they've mated within minutes. Um, put the cock with her for the past couple of days and she doesn't seem interested to mate. Um, she's built a nest, but well, we'll see. Uh, but yeah, I've got seven out of seven from her. Three the first round and four this round. Not one casualty, every egg is hatched, so I'm pleased. So, yeah, a couple of them have got a little um, yellow caps on. Hmm. Interesting, 
we shall see. Right, moving on to uh, some of the chicks. Um, I'll just show you the uh, the two red factors that I moved. They're uh, I'm not really sure these. They don't look too good. They're puffed up. One minute they're okay, and the next they're puffed up. Um, don't know. We'll see. Maybe they'll survive. I'm hoping they will. But yeah. So moving on to the lizards. And as you can see, they're fully flighted, flying from end to end. I'm in the process of colour feeding them at the moment. So hopefully in a few weeks start seeing a bit of colour in them. Moving on to the red factors. These are in process of being colour fed as well. Five of them in there so far. Like I said previously, I've got another three to add to this for the first round. So, yeah. They're coming on really well. And here's the air. Uh, the Gate Mosaic Opals. Three of them in there. They're from the first round. Um, it's from the hen that's got four. So, yeah, coming on really well. Okay. I'll make another video in another week. Bye for now.